Yeah. Would you like to go visit the water with me? We are in Yosemite National Park. One of my favorite places. Uh, one of Sarah's favorite places. One of our favorite places, right? Yes, it is. This is the first time we've been here together. It is, yeah. yeah. Uh, we both really like this place. Uh, it's, a, it's, it's wonderful, it's beautiful, it's magical. And we had to introduce it. Uh, <laughs> we had to introduce Alyssa to it. Uh, Alyssa likes the rocks. <laughs> <laughs> and the pine cones, and the right. sticks, and the dirt, and the mud, and the streams. The first time I came to Yosemite was about four years ago or so, and we were celebrating my sister's 30th birthday. She wanted to climb Half Dome. We had to get a special permit to do it. So it was kind of like a celebration slash challenge. Uh, so we kind of broke it up into three days. We did a little trek, we camped, and then we went up Half Dome, we came back. Uh, it was my first time coming to California, so it was just one of many wonderful, beautiful impressions that I had of California. And I remember coming in to the valley and seeing, you know, that scenic view with the sheer cliffs, and then, of course, seeing Half Dome in the distance that we were getting ready, and it was just in complete awe the entire time. And it was definitely a good challenge. Uh, I have a picture somewhere, maybe we'll splice it in, of uh, <laughs> me at the top. Uh, uh, and then uh, it's just wonderful to be back here again. And uh, it's much bigger than I remember. <laughs> we did our little loop and our hike, but this park is much bigger than I realized. The first time I came to Yosemite uh, was was a long, long time ago, uh, and uh, maybe like 20 years. I I was working as a tour guide in California, uh, and I was living in Ohio, uh, working on my PhD. But I spent the summer in California uh, working as an adventure tour guide, and I would pick up uh, groups of tourists in San Francisco. Francisco and then we would drive all over the state uh, doing going to different national parks and so forth so first time I came here was as a dr driver uh, with a bunch of tourists and I'll be honest like this is a, it was a van full of Italian tourists I was more into this place than they were. I wanted to pull over at every single place, take pictures, uh, enjoy it. Uh, once you get in here, it's amazing. Every view is spectacular. There are giant redwood trees, which if you're from the East Coast and uh, Eastern part of the United States, those are just amazing. Pictures don't do them justice. Uh, I love this place. And, uh, and every time I would meet somebody or find out that somebody hadn't been to Yosemite, I would encourage them to go. In fact, one day, I, incur I actually dragged my friend Paul uh, out here when he told me he had never been to Yosemite, despite living within only three or four hours from here his entire life. Uh, so I picked him up, I dragged him out here. That's what happens. Uh, and Liz, just so you know, if you don't get out here soon, you're next on that list. It's awesome. You guys should come visit. We're gonna, we're, we're not gonna shoot a whole lot of, uh, of uh, B-roll footage on this one because uh, we're just gonna take it all in and enjoy it. Sun's setting, and we need to enjoy some time with the baby. What did you find? Thank you, baby girl. about to test the underwater camera on a stick. I'm actually risking falling into this water just to get this shot, so it better be worth it. Here, I should probably descend this way so you can see the water as you go down.
I don't think we saw any fish, but some of that had to be kind of cool to look at, huh? 